Hi, my name is Nicola Jacks and I'm an HR professional. I'm currently um, working for an insurance brokerage in London, but previously I've worked in the legal sector and the finance sector. I've been in HR for around 13 years. Um, as long as I can remember, I've wanted to be um, in HR. However, it wasn't the only path that um, I you know, was interested in. Um, so when it came to my GCSEs um, and A-levels, I picked subjects that would help me perhaps in, in both. Um, and the other subject that I liked was um, marketing. Um, so I picked subjects like art um, and business studies that would help me um, look at the two career paths um, and help me form the choice that at university, I would also pick business studies um, so that I would learn about both, about both careers. Um, my course at university was what's called a sandwich course, um, which means um, in the middle of your um, degree, you take a year to work in industry. And for my year, I chose to um, work in marketing. So I had a marketing placement. Um, and I'm so grateful that I, I did um, because I realized that actually it wasn't where my heart, you know, my heart wanted to be. Um, and actually it was a career, um, you know, a, an HR career was, was for me. Um, so upon leaving university, I got myself into HR. Um, a lot of people actually don't know what HR is, um, but essentially it stands for human resources. So I look after the people of the business. So I am a, in some aspects, a recruiter. So I would interview candidates. I would look at CVs, um, invite them to interview um, with a potential view to hire. Um, I would then look after that person whilst they're employed um, and by look after I mean look after their um, contractual needs or things like sickness or you know maternity leave and, and things like that um, and I would see um, I would see them right until the end of their employment um, at, at times. Um, the good points are that it is really varied. Um, I deal with every single person in the business so all different types of people um, and you know that no one day is the same um, and I really get to build um, strong relationships with um, with the individuals in the business and the bad points I would say is that sometimes we have some difficult conversations that aren't you know aren't the nicest um, but it's all um, it's all part of the job um, but yeah if you're a people person and you like problem solving then I think that HR is a a career I would definitely recommend really really worthwhile and every sector every company will have some form of um, HR so chances are you probably won't be out of a job <laughs> um, which is handy um, in terms of tips I think that I've got some you know experience on both sides me being a candidate and me looking for a job but also me being on the other side and actually looking at CVs and interviewing um, candidates so my first um, my first tip would be to ask for help and help can be from as many people you know out there that you can that you can get there are many mentor schemes I would definitely recommend them you know and I would look for someone that you see um, a quality or a skill or an expertise and you think actually I could really benefit from that they can deal with um, helping you in a particular situation or a particular task um, yeah, just ask for help. No one does this by themselves. <laughs> and my second tip would be, um, and it's really important, but check your social media. Um, social media can be fr you know, fun and everything has its place. Um, unfortunately, when it comes to, you know, sort of employment in your career, um, what's out in the public domain shouldn't always be in the public domain. Um, so just make sure your accounts are private, make sure your profile pictures and things that you post um, are you know respectful and you know nothing that's going to um, embarrass you um, you know there isn't a candidate that I've interviewed that I haven't looked at their social media um, it just builds a picture of what they're about um, and um, companies will look for that so um, so yeah just just watch your social media thanks